Sean and Kathy, we're in the mouth of Yucca Mountain, just about 100 miles north of Las Vegas. This is the first media crew to tour the area since the president approved the location just last week. Now it's about a two mile locomotive ride to the inside. We're traveling down a man made cave. A giant drill began cutting this hole back in September of 1994. Now there are five miles of tunnels twisting in several directions. And the one we're walking into now is called the Thermal Test Alcove, and this is where we've done all of our heater tests. So come on down this way. When he's talking about the thermal test, he means they have to test the rock's ability to withstand heat generated by nuclear waste. Now this rock is no stranger to heat. It was born in a volcano. This rock itself is about 12.8 million years old. It's a volcanic it's rock so durable, scientists refer to it as tough. welded tough. Welded tough was rock that came in. It was about 1,500 degrees Fahrenheit when it hit the ground here, and it welded itself back together. But can it withstand so nuclear heat? For years, scientists have been asking that question by heating this chamber up to extreme temperatures and cooling it down again. Now the president has approved Yucca Mountain, and that changes a lot down here. Oh, very much so. We live in very exciting times. If Congress approves the construction of a nuclear repository down here, the Energy Department says it will be the largest civil construction project in the history of man bigger than the pyramids of Giza. This is the repository side here along this tunnel. About every 265 foot, there'd be an 18 foot diameter tunnel that would go down to about between three quarters and two thirds of a mile in that direction. And in these tunnels is where the waste would be in place. So you are at the repository horizon. Through solid rock, its main purpose to keep the radiation in and to keep rainwater out. If water was to get into the repository, it would have a tough time. From here on the top of Yucca Mountain, it's 1,400 feet to the repository level. Under that is another 1,000 feet of solid rock before you get to the water table. But nuclear waste mixing with water is the threat that has a lot of people concerned. We're on top of Yucca Mountain with more complete coverage. Dave Malkoff, News 13, inside Las Vegas.